love is difficult, yet unconditional, inspiring and unconventional. Love is carnal and complicated, but considered and clear. Love is fleeting. You have to be quick and catch it before it gets away. together in 1999 so however many years that is 24 24 yeah 24 years yeah uh how would you describe love love is i don't know it's this deep connection um that that binds and holds and heals? How would you describe love? Uh, love is work, but, you know, it's probably the most rewarding work. All right, what's your name? Brevin. How old are you? Uh, 24. Yeah. Uh, have you ever been in love, Brevin? Uh, yeah. I would say so. How would you describe it? Um, uh, can't really, I don't know. Just kind of, just when you feel it, just in love, man. What would you say it feels like? Pretty, pretty, pretty swag. <laughs> pretty good? Yeah. It's like euphoric. How would you put it physically, if you could? Um, it's like drugs, you know? Yeah. Like, like whippets, but prolonged. Sometimes love can stop before it even starts. Here is a dramatization of such a scenario. Yodelayihu! Welcome to the Lonely Goat Herd. Can I get you something to drink while you wait? No, thank you. <sighs> Sir, I don't mean to rush you, but the kitchen is closing. Are you sure there's nothing you want? Yeah, I'm, I'm fine. Thank you. You sit and you wait. It becomes clear she doesn't want you. No one wants you. You sit and your frustration becomes palpable. You sit and analyze everything you could have done differently. You sit and start to mourn a relationship that never even materialized. Despite this, it gets better. People can hurt you and kick you when you're down, but regardless of who hurts you or who leaves or whatever, you're still left over. You're the common denominator. Love comes from within, I hope. 